Hey everybody, Fred Herzog here on a beautiful, beautiful Saturday afternoon, about 1.30, uh, Saturday, April 26th. The reason I wanted to talk with you today is Jonathan and I were, were speaking last night, and uh, on a conference call I had mentioned three lists, and I kind of got him excited. He wanted me just to do a short video on that. Normally, uh, what really helps network marketing leaders uh, appreciate who they're working with is if the new individual gives them a list and that's going to kind of be a sifter or it helps you to appreciate who's really serious and you know who's not kidding around is they're actually going to give you a list of who they're going to be talking to either to get their investment back or to start building an organization so let's talk about the list uh, possibly the most hardest thing to get from people and that would be because those are the type of people you should have kept into your what I call holding tank or your client list or the third leg of our binary trinary uh, brand new word there anyway uh, I, I actually asked for three lists one is a customer list who do you know that could benefit from any one of our weight loss products any one of the eight categories of products that we have who do you know who do you know that would like to lose up to five pounds in five days? You know, who do you know that needs to lose 50 or 60 pounds in one month with our incredible HCG program? Um, those are the type of people that you want to put on your list. Okay, name, email, phone number. Okay, just write them on your list. Consumers, customers. The second list is who do you think that would be interested in building a business? Who do you think that needs some extra money? Who do you think wants another income stream? Um, you're going to write those names down. You're going to write their email and their phone numbers down. And now you could have the same person on both lists. That's important um, for you to understand. Put them there on both lists anyway. Um, okay, and third is what I call your chicken list. Why do I call it a chicken list? Well, that's because you are afraid, therefore you're a chicken, to contact them right now. Some of the reasons, well, let's say example, maybe you're a lawyer or your attorney if you have one, your doctor, dentist, any professional, educator, people who have a degree on their wall. You may feel intimidated and therefore afraid to talk to them because they have a higher education. They may drive a better car. They may have an, a nicer house. Um, they may have better jewelry or whatever it is. You feel that they are at a higher status or higher position than you are. So therefore, you are afraid to talk to them. What you're going to find out is that's where the money's made. You see, people that already have a lot of money have already gone through some type of mental conditioning, mental training, to expect more than they've already gotten. They've stepped out on a limb. Um, they know they're worth more than what other people would think of them. They know that. They're entrepreneurs. So therefore, they're not afraid. But a lot of times we get involved into a business, we're not quite sure exactly what to do. Maybe it's our first business. But what I want you to do is make those three lists, and you're going to kind of experiment almost, test the waters on people you know. Now, they're going to possibly or probably say no to you, but they're not going to slap you in the face. They're not going to punch you. They're not going to degrade you or demean you or really make fun of you. You know, they may tell you, go get a real job. You know, are you going to try to, you know, become an owner of a business? You're not qualified. But I mean, they're still going to love you. They're still going to be your friends. Practice on them. Get to uh, understand the feeling of rejection. It's okay. It's okay to be rejected. Because that's going to show you the people you're talking to are the wrong people. You see, when you're piquing people's interest, we're looking for the people who have the right mindset and who want to get out of their current circumstances right now. And so when you come up against any resistance to what you're saying, drop it. Hey, not a problem, just taking a survey. Just want to see, 
What's, you know, what's going on in your world? And change the subject. So anyway, well, how's your favorite sports team doing? Get out of there. Back off. Don't lose a friend or friendship over a business. So you're going to practice on these first two. You're probably going to get some people that are interested and may join you. But once you get through your learning curve, once you get the confidence, once you start realizing that, wow, people really are interested in this program, it's very simplistic, the price points are right, the products work, the compensation is unheard of in our industry, and it's a, a fantastic recipe for success. And then, of course, by that time, your product is right at your house, you've started drinking the tea or using the other products that we have, whichever one you decided, and now your belief system goes up because you know the products work. You don't have to convince yourself anymore. So that gives you more strength, more power, more determination to go on. So make those three lists. Work on your lists. Get them ready and give them to your sponsor. The next video, we're going to show you what you should do with that. But that's your first homework assignment. And Jonathan in Texas, Jonathan Puga and I are going to find out through this short exercise of who we're going to work with. You see, I learned 20 years ago by someone who was making over a million dollars a year in the industry. He said something. Please don't take this as a haughty statement because, you know, we have to respect our time too. But he said, we need to work where we are deserved, not needed. And so we want to find out who's really serious and not kidding around. Get your three lists or at least your two lists. Start working on your third list. Hand them in to your sponsor. And then we'll go to the next step. Thanks. Have a fantastic day. Make a difference in someone's life. Take care.